Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Jeremy Cash live and direct with another valuable video for you. Today is a Forex challenge, guys. Kind of like a case study with CPA, but I bet you guys that I can win five trades in a row in your face live. Okay? So, let's just wait on it, man. Let me look at a few of these pairs. Let me see if it's anything that I want to do. This one looks, you know, uh, the most convincing. This one here. So we'll rock with it. So I'm going to do, wait, here it is. Wait on it. Let me see. Uh, not yet, not yet, not yet. I'll wait on it. And this is just one of the strategies that we use, guys. Uh, it's a killer strategy, man. You, you're you going to see why, you know, uh, a lot of the teammates are making money. Making good money, too. Uh... It's holding, so I'm just waiting, guys. I'm just waiting for a certain thing. I'm not going to tell you what, but, you know. All right. So, all right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five. All right, five trades, guys, in a row. So, now, I'm losing 200 some dollars right, right now. But I can assure you that I'm going to be in profit pretty soon guys this strategy is killer and it works pretty much i in my eyes 95 percent of the time guys right i wonder if any of you can figure out what strategy i'm using if you can figure it out then i don't know <laughs> but i love this strategy guys this is a forex strategy that a lot of people don't really talk about much because a lot of people have no clue at what i'm doing right but i can assure you <laughs> that i'm going to be in profit guys oh i can assure it you see what i'm saying so we just sit around and we wait as you can see you know the money's fluctuating and it'll do that for for some time but after it's all said and done we'll be in profit I can close out and uh, bingo. Here we go. In profit. <laughs> Look at that, man. In profit already, as I said, right? Didn't I tell you guys I could promise you that I was going to be in profit? Oh, and it works. Oh, and it works, man. Can we get to 200? Oh, we're almost there. Let's see. Uh, I want to see if we can get to two. Yeah, uh, let's see. Can we get to 200? Because it's going to fluctuate for a little bit. So, let's just see what it does, guys. Let's just see what it does. Easy money, man. I'm telling you. Easy money. Yeah, so I'm back. My bad, man. My wife had called. You know what I'm saying? So, But how am I able to predict the market guys with this strategy i mean we can do numbers like this all the all the time and so i call this my paid every day strategy guys imagine let me see what we're gonna do what are we gonna do imagine you know i'll take my 174 dollars for the hour right imagine making you know anywhere from you know a hundred to three hundred dollars an hour guys like what is that Let, let's let's just calculate that guys but yeah, guys, let's let's go to the calculator, right? And let's just see how much one hundred dollars times eight hours. Of course, we know it's eight hundred dollars, right? But let's say you only want to do four hours, and you want to make a hundred dollars an hour. You want to trade for now nah, five hours. Let's say you want to trade for five hours. That's five hundred dollars, right? Five hundred dollars. And let's say you want to trade Monday through Friday times five. That's $2,500 a week. $2,500 a week times four. That's $10,000 a month, guys. Bingo. That's that lucky number. Easy, right? And you do $10,000 a month times uh, 12 months. Let's get it, man. $120,000 a year. Uh, $120,000 a year, guys. That's my paid everyday strategy, guys. That's why Forex is so important to learn. 
why is it that I'm telling you this, guys? Because, yes, yeah, CPA is amazing, right? CPA is great. But when you learn a skill like Forex, guys, like we're, we're talking no recruiting. We don't have to convince nobody to go through a landing page. We don't have to convince people to, hey, fill out a form. You don't have to do any of that. The only thing you have to do is wake up, make your money, and then and then shut your computer down, right? That was, what, $174 in, in one hour. And right now it's like 11 o'clock. So, right, so I don't have to trade again until 12 o'clock. Or I can trade all the way through 11 o'clock and just make all the money I want to for that day and be done. But that strategy right there, I call it my paid everyday strategy. It's like 95% uh, wins if you do it correctly, right? And the team knows that, and the team's been practicing that strategy. Uh, and, it, I mean, it works like clockwork, guys. It works like clockwork. I'll, I'll come here just to show you. This is, you know, one of our groups. Uh, Michael's killing it. Shout outs to Michael because I know he's watching. He's been killing it, guys. He's killing it. Uh, a few other people in here are killing it, man. Like, this is just me giving out, you know, signals. Once again, Michael's kind of been in here teaching, you know, showing, you know, his his results and things like that. Uh, but like I said, guys, uh, Rudy Brown is, is definitely killing it. As you can see, this is Rudy right here. He's been killing it. I mean, guys, so we have people, you know, that are doing really great things. And I mean, there's more in there, right? And let's let just wait. Let me go back, man. Let me just show you guys uh, a little bit, a little bit more. Let's just let's just keep scrolling up, guys. Let's go all the way up until uh, Randy, you know, was killing it. Shout outs to Randy. He's been killing. Uh, shout outs to everybody, man. Shout outs to uh, Holly. Shout outs to uh voodoo uh voodoo i guess that's your name v something like that they, they've been killing it uh christina's killing it francisco everybody right but let's go up here uh to my guy it may be francisco because somebody posted it a while back let me keep scrolling let me keep scrolling see we got a lot of stuff to talk about in this group so Boom, Francisco, just by following Jeremy's strategies, guys, look look at what he's been able to do, All right? Killing it, profit, profit, one loss, profit, 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 guys. The strategies, they work. All right, they work, guys. Let's take a look at this one. No losses. Profit, 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 profit. How are they able to do that? Exactly how I just showed you, All right? This is the kind of stuff that we're able to do because you know we plug into the right training and the right people forex is not as hard as people make it seem but if you have the right training and mentorship you can kill it man like what you know what could a hundred and twenty thousand dollars a year do for your family right making an extra 10 let's just like again right let's let's go back to the because i made a video talking about ten thousand dollars a month you know but let's just you know let's go over it again right let's say you make ten thousand dollars a month off one stream of income mind you you're probably going to have more streams of income so that'll go up right but let's just say right you see how easy how simple it was that i made 174 dollars now there were a couple things factored into that typically with around 500 to a thousand dollars in your account you can make bigger trades guys right you can make bigger trades with 500 to a thousand dollars in your account okay so anytime you want to you know increase your lot size right where what you just saw had a three standard lot size meaning i was you know betting three dollars off of my you know thousand plus dollars right so anytime you have a bigger lot size you're making a riskier trade or a bigger trade but you could also make way more money when you do it that way especially with the strategy that i just showed you right but for instance let's say you got you know ten thousand dollars a month let's calculate let's say i know some of you guys are young so you don't have a mortgage or rent but some of you do so let's just say you're paying rent at your house or apartment or whatever right and let's just say you wanted to stay somewhere really nice so your rent let's just go on the high end your rent is twenty four hundred dollars a month right well that's probably normal for some of you depending on where you stay but where i stay that's extremely high I live in oklahoma so our this cost of living here is super low right so a great apartment here would probably be like 700 bucks a month but 2400 is kind of extreme on my end right so let's say you get you a nice apartment or or a rent house or whatever 2400 a month for your mortgage right or your rent 
All right, and then we can minus, let's say for all your bills, electric bill, cable bill, whatever, uh, phone, all of that. Let's say that comes out to an extra 2300 right? Boom. Let's say you buy groceries if you're not on food stamps. Let's say you just buy groceries. You feel me? You just want to spend some, let's say you spend 300 a month on groceries. After all that is left over, how much do you still have left? Get out of here. Do you hear me? $5,000 left. Now that's cash flow. And that's just one stream of income, guys. Are you hearing me? One stream. Oh, man. This, this stuff is just insane. Now, just imagine you throw some CPA commissions on top of that, some more affiliate commissions, and then some other stuff that you do outside of online marketing. I do photography and video, so I can throw that in there. I mean, it's just your cash flow is going to be ridiculous. And so with what I'm saying is what you can do with Forex is just simply amazing. I mean, and the fact that you can make that kind of money uh, in in I, I don't want to say that fast because I don't want you to make it seem like it's a get rich quick scheme because it's not. But once you learn it, it, it can be a huge money maker. It can be like printing money. It's like you're your own ATM guy. So that's why I kind of push. If you look on my Instagram, I push Forex a lot more than I do CPA because Forex is what I do majority of the time. I love Forex, man. It's just you can't. Once you start to do it correctly, you'll see exactly what I mean by that. But, guys, that's the power in Forex, right? I mean, you can just run the numbers, guys. All I'm telling you to do, whatever it is that you're doing, whether you, some, some people may just hate Forex and don't want to do it. But if you want to do anything, run the numbers. How much do I need to make per day to get to my goal, right? How much do you need to make per day, right? So maybe you need it or, or per hour run the numbers in the calculator and say okay well i only need to make you know let's say I'll, let's say you at your job and you only make 15 dollars an hour and you like ah, i want to add an extra i want to make what's your uh you know desired salary so 40 dollars an hour so let's say in the market you just want to do 40 dollars each hour you make your 40 dollars you're out you wait to the next hour make another 40 dollars and you're out you could just keep doing that all week long but let's say 40 dollars times let's say you trade for five hours right that's 200 bucks 200, we're going to go times five, Monday through Friday. Let's say that. $1,000 a week. Let's say you make $1,000 a week. We times that by four weeks in a month. 4000 a month is how much a year? We're probably looking at around fifty grand a year. Let's see. Yep, about fifty grand. So $48,000 a year, right? On top of your job. So let's say at your job you make what thirty thousand. If you're making about fifteen dollars an hour, you probably make around thirty thousand dollars. So plus, let's just say thirty-two thousand dollars a year on your job plus uh, forex or whatever it is that you're doing. That brings you to eighty thousand dollars a year, guys. Eighty thousand dollars a year. That's like lawyer income headed into the doctor income, right? Lower your doctor. That's like they're, they're, they're low end because most of the time they're making, you know, 150, 200,000 some dollars a year when they're, you know, really good at what they're doing. But their, their starter, you know, packages, when, they're, when they first start, they're usually around 80,000, you know. So you're making that kind of money from home, guys. But another thing that I was going to tell you is to start using the bank's money, guys. That's the reason why credit cards and stuff are so important and stuff like this because let's say you don't have it let's just say you don't have a dime in your pocket let's just say you is super broke right you don't got no money how is it that you can go and fund your forex account an extra thousand or two thousand dollars so you can make bigger trades and make more money right how is that now some of you might say oh that's dumb advice oh no it's not it's just the fact that people taught you to to not use credit cards or to not use them at all right they didn't tell you about zero percent interest credit cards for 18 to 12 months they didn't tell you about that right they just told you not to use them because they jacked their credit up using it because they didn't know what they were doing right they never told you to use it for investments right so imagine you you know you've been working on your credit and if you need to work on your credit guys 
for my people who are in the country, uh, United States, for you are outside of the country, I don't know how y'all still work, so I can't really speak on that. But for those of you who, you know, let's just say you've been working on your credit in the bank, they give you $10,000 credit card. Let's say you got to like a 680, 700, you apply for a card, uh, you got $10,000, right? They just give you the money, guys. The banks will just give you the money, right? So if you don't have no money, use the bank's money. They'll give it to you, all of it, right? Now, let's say you got 0% interest, right? You got a $10,000 credit card, boom. Uh, then you decide you want to go apply for one more, you get $15,000, right? You apply for, let's say, one more, you get, uh, on the low end, you get a $3,000 credit card, right? So now let's say you got $28,000 in your pocket to now that you can use for investment tool. And let's just say, for instance, all three of these are 0% interest cards, right? That means you don't pay any interest at all, right? So let's just say out of that, you know, $28,000, you decided to do, let's just say you wanted to put uh, $2,000 in there, right? Still got $26,000 left. Now you got $2,000 in your trading account. $2,000 in your trading account, guys. What could you do with that? Exactly what I just did. The same thing you saw me do is the same thing that you can do. And guess what? By the end, matter of fact, okay, so let's say you put your 2000 in, 26000 right? So let's say you just made $100 a day, right? Well, not $100 a day because you're doing $500 a day. My bad because we did $100 an hour for five hours, right? Times that by five brings us to 2500 Did you or did you not make the money? to pay that credit card back. Correct, you did, absolutely, you absolutely did. So guess what, let's minus what you took out, $2,000, right, off of your credit card. That leaves you with $500 in profit and you started with $0. How does that happen, guys? But guess what, the crazy thing about credit cards is it's revolving, so guess what? Once you take that money out, you pay it back, guess what, that money is now back on your credit card so my question to you is did you really spend two thousand dollars if you still have it you didn't that's what they don't tell you right you put your two thousand dollars back on your credit card and now you can still use that same two thousand dollars for a different investment and now you have five hundred dollars extra in your pocket that you can now trade off of right or you can keep that uh since you have zero percent interest for like 18 or 12 months it doesn't matter because you're not going to get charged interest for that amount of time. So guess what? You don't even have to put the $2,000 back on there. You can keep trading off of that, right? You can continue to trade off of it and trade off of it and multiply your account and continue to multiply it. By the time that that interest comes back around, you won't even have to pay it, right? The only, listen, guys, listen to me. The reason why credit cards are so powerful, guys, the only time that you're going to ever pay money off of it is if you pay interest. What do I mean by that? Right, and this is a lesson in forex and credit card, guys. I'm trying to give you the game. This is what people have been doing. This is why a lot of you have been lost because you don't know this stuff, right? So think about this. Think about it, right? Let's just let me give you an example. Two thousand dollar. Let's say you had a two thousand dollar credit card, right? And let's say you bought, you got on Craigslist. Nah, let me give you a bigger limit. A bigger limit. Let's say you got five thousand dollars, right? And let's say you got on Craigslist and you're just looking for a little car, you know, let's say you're young or whatever, you just wanted to you get a car, you needed a car, you're like, ah, I need a car, man. All right, so let's just say you bought a car, you took 3000 off the card, you got you a nice car to ride around in, bingo, you got $2,000 left on there, but you owe 3000 on the car, you got 12 months to pay that back. Hmm. So, let's just say... And let's say this is a a a zero percent interest credit card, right? Uh, you get you got a job, so you taking your money off, and you end up paying that three thousand dollars back. Guys, you got the car for free. Do you get what I'm saying? How did you get the car for free? Because you didn't pay interest. You just paid yourself back. It's like you're using your credit card as a check in a savings account, especially when you have zero percent interest. Once you pay that money back, you didn't pay interest, so all you did was just pay yourself back. You still have the complete $5,000, and then you have a new car. Do you see the value in that? Now, for in, let me give you a different example. Let's say you did pay interest, and you pay like 21% interest, right, on that. And you probably end up paying like, I don't know, somewhere probably around like $174 or something like that, right? 
over that period of time, maybe a little bit more, maybe 200. Let's say you paid $250 in interest, right? At the end of the day, once you paid that $3,000 back, guys, the only the only thing you did was pay for the car. I mean, the, the amount that you paid for the car was only $250 instead of $3,000. How is that? Because you only, listen, the $3,000 you got back. The only thing you didn't get back is the interest payments. So you basically bought the car for $250 because the $250 in interest is money that you didn't get back. The rest of it, you got back. So you bought you a car for $250. So that is the power in credit cards, guys. You got to use it for investments and use it to multiply your money. And that's why Forex is the perfect way to do that. But that's all I have for you today, guys. Hopefully this was an inspiration. I do have a $50 Forex course below until Thanksgiving. And you will be in the group trading with us. So if that's something you want to do, go ahead and get started. If not, hey, like I said, you don't need our group to trade Forex. I mean, you could trade Forex for free by yourself. I mean, hey, but it's completely up to you, you know. Hey, but other than that, guys, subscribe. I got more videos coming. I just feel like this was, you know, much needed to say. Hopefully you made it to the end. If you did, give me a comment. And I will see you guys in another video. Peace.